Hey guys, CYHD here, and I am back with another reaction video. Okay, so um, today, um, Obev Squiller posted another MLP comic dub today, but as for this one, this is a full cast MLP comic dub. And this one is called Blood is Thicker. So as for this comic dub, it's a grimdark and a tragedy and a romance um, comic dub. So, um... Yeah, um, when I looked at the thumbnail, it had to do with a young Granny Smith. I wonder if it has to do with something with her past. Let's find out. Anyways, let's jump right in! Huh. Sweet intro, Scribbler! Scribbler Productions. Ah, yes. The Nightmare Night intro. Month of Mac Macabre. Oh. Okay, this is pretty tame. Pretty tame. Blood is thicker. An MLP project. I met a little filly who makes me feel quite silly Like I've got sugar in my soul Her eyes make me feel funny Butterflies form in my tummy And my heart beats out of control Oh, please. That's Granny Smith's say husband. That you love me, and that if push comes to shove, we will keep us from falling apart. <laughs> Pretty little filly, you make me feel so silly. So please don't break my heart. Oh, Lucy. You sure know how to make a little old farm gal feel special. And you have a talent to inspire me, love. Mm. <coughs> <gasps> oh, pony's sake, Silver, you scared us half to death. My apologies for interrupting your courtship of Miss Apple, young master. But your grandfather sent for you. Grandfather? Oh, he must be dead by now. I don't mean to be a negative Nelly, but... Your granddad don't seem overly fond of me. Oh, hush. He's never seemed overly fond of any pony. I'm overly fond of you, and that's what matters. He's always been sort of... cold. But given time, he's sure to accept you. He just looks so... mean. I promise you, he's utterly heartless. Ugh. He has a scar in his eye. Miss Apple? M Mr. Sprout? May I please speak to my grandson alone? Huh? What's gonna happen? Hmm. What? Why would he write you out of his wheel? Lose the apple trash. Apple trash? A very strong disagreement. But that's okay. I've got plenty. I have enough of my own money to pour into my own ventures. And with you by my side, I can endure any hardship. Why does Grandfather hate Earth Ponies? I don't get it. Better question, who cares? I thought you didn't want his money. It's not the money. Simple curiosity mixed with a hope to get his blessing. 
Blessing? For this. Oh! Oh, bro. You gonna give that to so Granny Snap? What would the pony say? Ha ha, you're a comedian. <laughs> a comedian! Are you sure? She is sort of beneath us. Well, not you too obscure. Not me too. She's a farm mare, and you're of noble pedigree. You think you can raise her? Doesn't matter if I can't. Huh? Uh oh. Secret door? What's wrong, Lou? If I told you, you wouldn't believe me, love. Or worse, you would believe every word. Lou? You're scaring me here. Granny Smith sounds like she has Applejack's voice. My family is cursed, love. Oh! An ancient evil curse. When my grandfather dies, do not trust whoever finds his body. We're cattle. Any one of us could be next. Our fortunes and intellect are no accident. We're bred to be perfect. Perfect suits of flesh for a demon. We're spares, as are our children and their children. It has to end. Yeah, it must end. We got the thunder and lightning. don't have to do anything heroic. Just grab evidence and get out. How did I never notice how intimidating this house is at night? Oh, love. I wish you were... Oh! That was pretty sudden. know you know too much. Let's chat. Isn't that his brother? Obscure. Oh please. He found the room at the same time you did. I know what he knows. So there's no point in playing games. I hear it so little, so please use my true name. Red Harvest. Red Harvest? Yes. <laughs> it's been mm, 300 years since I've heard another pony say my name. And I did so like that. Is this brother a demon? She just never knew when to stop asking questions. This one? He was bold. He came here to offer himself to me to spare you his fate. It was touching, really. Obscure, no. It works out, really. He's capable, but I never really liked him. His joints, they don't take it all. I can see things, too. You can't imagine the sheer ecstasy of being young again. You, you're vile. A, a demon. <gasps> Lucid, I'm hurt. I'm still dear old granddad, just wearing a new coat. I never knew. Grandfather! Wrong answer. Oh! Oh! oh. Please believe me when I say I didn't want to have to do that. I was going to let you live. Now I have to dispose of you and the old body. Now, as you die, 
Take solace in knowing that I am oddly proud of you. Bro. Lou? You home? I, I want to talk. It's kind of important. Open up. Mr. Sprout? S Silver? Any pony? He's dead. Is any pony here? Some pony, say something. Uh, any pony in here? <gasps> yeah, he's dead. <gasps> <No>. <gasps> Just hold him. You, you, you will make some pony very happy someday. It may take time, but you will love again. You must be strong, though. I'm pregnant. You're oh. gonna be a daddy. Uh, so Granny's already a parent. Is he dead now? He must be. Yeah, he, he's dead. He's hardly breathing. No, it's up to Granny Smith to. Saying 
it's now up to Granny Smith to defeat that guy. That demon pony. He killed his own grandfather. You sure this is a good idea, Apple Bloom? Yep. It's now we got the CMC. And no ponies lived in it since forever. Yeah, it's just gotta be haunted or something. Kill you are my investigators! investigators! Yay! I heard a crazy pony set fire to the place to kill the nobles that lived here. I heard it was struck by lightning. I heard it was cursed, and I get spunkin' if I go inside. Anypony else hearing you, Galilee? Huh, looks like no pony thought to cover the roof. I wonder if we could see a ghost if we camped here for a night. I swear I hear a ukulele. Um, uh, I wonder. No, last for a podcast quiz! Ugh. Good thing this floor broke my fall. Ow. Now, where am I? A library? Well, look at all those scrapped like books. books. You know, I fall, the books weren't burned. <sighs> Yeah, you gotta be extra careful. There's that music again. I met a little filly who makes me feel quite silly. Like that I've song. got sugar in my soul. Her eyes make me feel funny. Butterflies form in my tummy, and my heart beats out of control. Oh, please say that you what happened? love me. He's dead. And that if push comes to shove, we will keep us from falling apart. <laughs> Pretty little filly, you make me feel so silly, so please don't break my heart. Hmm? Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't expecting an audience. Please, come in. Who are you? You look familiar. Oh, I'm no pony you know, little one. Just a tired old stallion. You don't look that old. <laughs> Why, thank you. Yeah, he is I guess pretty I old. Do look young for my age. So, what's a little filly like yourself doing in this tomb? Tomb? Looking for ghosts. Oh, how fun. Find any yet? Nah, just dirt and junk. What about you? Oh, waiting for my brother. Your brother? He's sleeping right now. And when he wakes up... How are they still up, alive? I want to be there. I mean, didn't he get so killed? he wasn't alone. Yeah, my brother sleeps too sometimes. Always makes Granny mad. <laughs> I'm sure your grandparents are proud nonetheless. Granny, maybe. My granddad died a long time ago. Well, I'm sure he is. Of you... Your brother, your sister. Sister? I didn't. Apple Bloom, you hear? Hey! The Spectre Detector Twilight made for us was glowing! Until just a second ago, anyway. Oh, night! You hear? We found a. ghost? He's gone. It was probably just your imagination, I guess. And happy Father's Day. That was probably for um, Apple Bloom's great granddad. Oh, man. Don't call it audio fix. Nay, Raider Pony. Scribbler. 
Annie Smith? So, Granny Smith's elder name was Granny Smith, and her youngin name is Annie Smith? Okay then. Hey, Ice Case. Goombasa? Reverb Brownie? You can read the sequel to this story. Edited at MLB Project The Dark Crown at MetalKitty.DeviantArt. Why can't you just make a sequel to that? Square Blend? Well then, that was <clears throat> pretty freaking amazing. So yeah, um, it's about a tragic love story between this guy Lucid and Amy Smith. And then, in the middle of the story, Lucid finds out that his brother, Obscure, is actually a demon. And then, he kills him! Well, basically, his brother just kills him. He didn't kill his brother. And then, Granny Smith finds him hurt... And then Granny Smith agrees to marry him, and then bam, he just dies like that. And then Apple Boom just finds him, and then her friends found a ghost detector that was working, and then she turns around back to the chair, and then he's gone. And then by the fire stand, there was a guitar that says, Happy Father's Day. Why did it say Father's Day? It's Halloween right now! I have no idea. But, jeez, that was a really great, well, full cast comic dub. That, that was really well edited. Once again, guys, thanks for watching, and ahoy!